Hey, it's Central Valley Business. I'm your host, Steve Walling. My guest for this segment is Cliff Long with Royal Security. Cliff, welcome back to the show. Steve. You've been with us before. I'm glad that you're you're here today. Uh, a lot of exciting things going on in the world of security. What absolutely, absolutely. No, you know, the last time you were here, we showed a video. Uh, Mike, have we got that video access by chance? Okay, this is a video of one of your clients where someone was actually breaking into the car, and because they had this video in there as part of their security system, the, the police were able to apprehend this person, right? Right. So that's one of the main things that we wanted to touch on today was regarding cameras um, and surveillance. Uh, we're one of the companies out there that is offering the cameras uh, and a different type of camera for a residential application. Well, I'm going to stop you right there. I mean, cameras, they are, they are the big thing today. But there's a lot of those do-it-yourselfer things, you know, that you peel off the stuff, you stick the camera up there, and you're good to go, right? Correct. But that yeah. doesn't always make it good to go, does it? Not 100%. And that's, and that's another thing. There's a lot of do-it-yourself uh, systems out there, cameras that you can get. Uh, you could purchase online. Uh, there's a lot of uh, things that you can do to make yourself a little bit safer. However, the main thing that we wanted to let you guys know is that with those newer cameras, like, for example, the rings, the cameras that you can install yourself, not a lot of folks know how to install them yourself. Not everybody can do it themselves. You know, um, and, and I want to ask you about that, you know, because it's not only about the actual putting the camera up or trying to get it, you know, programmed to your, you know, whatever your central base thing is. But it's also the location of the camera and the direction of, the, of that camera. Because, you know, as a, as a security expert, you know, when you walk in, you evaluate, you know, you have the history and the knowledge of saying, you know, this, this area over here is, is probably not going to be, you know, a prime target for somebody. But this o area over here, you know, is going to be, and you can, you can help them in laying out, that out right right that's actually what we do that's what we specialize in see a lot of times when folks think that you know okay we're gonna put a, a a ring doorbell on the front of the house okay we're completely covered and we're safe well that's false because if somebody were smart enough all they have to do is go around the back and avoid the front camera and nothing gets caught or they could just cover themselves disguise themselves and you never truly see who it is the main thing is if something happens, we want to be notified, and the homeowner or the person who's in the house, want you want to be the first one to know. That's a kind of a good thing, isn't it? Right, and it does do that. It does do that. It does, does contact. It? it does It does alert you. It does contact you. However, yeah. there is no third party that's contacted, for example, uh, law enforcement or police. So mm -hmm. if there was a situation or scenario where we actually needed uh, somebody to come out and we're not able to do that, um, who are we going to call? Okay. So um, the, what ours does, our security system actually contacts the third party. So we have a professional monitor company. I mean, which, so just informing me, which I think is a pretty good thing, yes. isn't going to necessarily be enough, right? Right. And, and so one of the reasons why I, I may want to consider something other than just a do-it-yourself is, you know, what you provide. And in, in, you get a hold of the police, right? Correct. And, yeah. and, and they actually respond to your calls. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's not like calling from the house and saying, hey, you know, I need something. That, well, you know, we're, we're on our lunch break or whatever. We'll be there later. <laughs> right. No, I'm, I'm kind of being humorous, but the deal is yeah. you, you do this. How long have you been doing this now? I've been doing this for about almost seven years. Really? So, yeah. And in, in my experience, what I've noticed is that those, those new cameras, like uh, the ones that you could put on the door or the little nanny cams mm -hmm. you could put in the house, it's just like a Band-Aid, you know. It'll, it, it'll give you guys the coverage that you're looking for as far as, you know, having eyes in the house and being Makes able to, feel to listen in the house. However, uh, the main concern is if something happens, if we have an emergency or we have a situation we need to get a hold of someone, we're not going to be able to. And, and Cliff, I want to ask you. Besides the fact of, of somebody coming into the house, do, does your company provide, like, for, you know, alerts when it comes to, like, fire, stuff like that? Yes, yes. You do? Yes, we do. And, and also, again, then you get a hold of the third party. Correct. So a lot of the do-it-yourself things, it's, you know, they got pictures of people walking around, but if there's pictures of flames going, you know, they may not be, you know, it's nice to see it on your cell phone. Gee, my house is burning down, but... That doesn't really help, does it? <laughs> right, right. And that's, that's absolutely true, Steve. So 
uh, not only are we protecting your home from a burglary or potential break-in, uh, there's other things that our services offer. So, for example, a fire uh, for elderly people or people who have medical conditions, if you need to get a hold of emergency services, um, it's a press of a button rather than getting on the phone and calling 911, getting transferred over to the 911 station, which are state employees. Then they're going to go through a process of asking you a series of questions. Right. By the time they get that information in order to help you, they're going to contact the agency that's going to respond to your address. And physically, to arrive at your address, there, there's a process there. Yeah. So uh, with it's not ours... not necessarily a good thing, having all that extra time involved, is it? No, especially if you're having a real emergency, it's really not. Yeah. Well, Cliff, I want to thank you for being with us today. But before we Absolutely. go, how do they get a hold of you? Oh, that's easy. So we're doing a special right now. If you guys have had an incident at your home, a theft, maybe the kid's bike was stolen in front of the yard, maybe they broke into the car, maybe they stole the car, or anything like that, I'm talking directly to you. We have a promotion right now where we can get you guys set up with the security camera in front of your home and a full security system for all the doors and windows at no cost out of pocket. Call me at my number today, 559-779-4344, and ask me how. That's awesome. What an opportunity for someone. Absolutely. You know, it's, it's tough when, you, when you've been through. One of the things about, you know, a lot of people don't realize that if you've ever had a break-in in your house, it, it's, it's, like a, it, it's more than just a, a mechanical thing that's a break-in. It is a, 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 like a, a personal violation. Oh, yeah. And, uh, that, you know, that you would provide that opportunity for, for individuals that have been in those situations is dynamite. Absolutely. So I agree. We'll have to do this again. Yeah, for All sure. Right? Get a hold of them. You got a security. You have a potential security issue. You have an uh, issue where you're thinking about having a security issue. You had a security issue, um, and anything else having to do with a security issue. Get a hold of Cliff. You can look him up, or you can give him a call. Look him up where again? You guys can look up our website. It's going to be royal security dot com, or you guys can just give me a call here at five five nine seven seven nine four three four four. That's it. You got it. You heard it from the man. Cliff, thanks for being on the show again. Thank you, Steve. We'll see you soon. And All I'll right. see you when we come back.